Welcome back, folks, to the Millennium Bowling Supply YouTube channel. Chase Valenzuela here with something a little bit different today. So we're actually going to do an unboxing of the new 3G Tour Black. Uh, so I was really excited to see these when they came out. Uh, you know, black on black is something that's super marketable. It works with everything. Um, you know, the orange for me was not something I would wear a lot. So I ended up not ordering a pair of those. Um, but these were actually sent to our Pro Shop. They're part of our Pro Shop VIP package. So we're going to go ahead and get into these here and see what comes in the box. If you want to see more videos like this, we have a pair of the 3G uh, Gold Belmo shoes that we could unbox and, and show you guys. And we have a pair. I have a pair of the Tour X's that I haven't worn yet. So if you'd like to see an unboxing of the 3G Tour X's or the Belmo Gold 3G's that just came out that were limited edition, uh, let me know down in the comments. All right, so opening the box here, getting these out. I don't see any additional soles other than what's on the shoe. So you have that uh, oiled leather here on the bottom of the 3G shoe. It's got that frame around it. Um, and then you've got the interchangeable here, which it's in there straight from the factory. So I can't quite get it out. I don't have long fingernails. All right, so you see these 3G Tour black here. So you have the that kind of matte leather makes up most of the body here with the big cushions on the side. And then you've got some ventilation here on the bottom. So right in between that heel and the slide sole, you've got this screen ventilated area. There are holes that vent out to that in the insole of the shoe. So that's to help you stay cool in this entirely leather shoe. Um, the patent leather accents are black as well. Now those are really shiny. You can probably see on camera that you've got the sort of flat leather that's not reflecting a lot of light, and then this bright black patent leather is really shiny. So I think these would look really cool with just about anything. They're nice because they have some detail, they have some contrast, but they don't stand out, and they're not some crazy color that might interfere with something else that you're wearing. So if you're someone that wears like a lot of colorful jerseys or something, I think these would be really nice because they've got some texture, but they're also very plain and very uh, interchangeable with other outfits and color combinations. So you've got the sort of classic thick 3G laces. They're very wide. Um, that's pretty much been on every 3G shoe that's come out even before Storm acquired them whenever they were an independent company. If you don't know, Storm owns 3G now as well as 900 Global. Um, so that is the 3G Tour Blacks. Now I've not actually bowled in a pair of these 3Gs in a minute. I had some of the Sport Ultras that were red and black uh, probably four or five years ago that I really enjoyed. So I'm excited to get into my Tour X's, which I'm sure will fit similarly to these, and I'll let you know. Um, I did have to order, so if you're a size, I'm a size nine regular in the Dexter SST 6's. They do run pretty wide. I'm a size 10 in just a regular tennis shoe, like a Nike or an Adidas tennis shoe. Um, if you're a size nine in those SST 6 BOAs, I actually had to order a nine wide in my uh, Tour X's for them to fit correctly because I was so used to that wider platform. My foot's a little bit wider. Uh, so to give you an idea of sizing, these are an 11 regular. If you wore, you know, maybe the SST 8s or something that's not on that super wide uh, frame the way that the 6 is, I think you could probably be okay just going across uh, from your Dexter size. I think they run similarly to Dexter's. Uh, for me, I liked the SST 6s because my foot's wider. And so I think uh, if you do have a wide foot and you are a fan of those sixes because they're wide, you're going to have to order a wide in these 3G shoes. So let me know what you think. Let me know if you liked this uh, unboxing video here. Once again, no, no extra soles. Uh, we got some, just some packaging and some shoes. So I think the uh, 3G Tour Color Cs do come with all of the soles. That's the orange and black ones. These Tour Black looks like they come with just the one oiled leather sole that's on the front here. So... Other than that, uh, pretty standard 3G shoe construction here. You've got this toe cap. It feels stationary. It doesn't feel like it could come off, um, which I think they're typically modular. So I don't, I don't feel this one going anywhere, which is nice. I actually like the stationary push-off foot um, because it's just less stuff that can go wrong, less Velcro that can fail. So uh, other than that, we got some packaging in the shoes here. I, uh, I'm a big fan of shoe trees. If you've got leather shoes, leather bowling shoes, you want to keep them looking new, get some of those shoe trees that go in, stretch them out. Uh, keep them from getting creased, keep them looking nice and new. I've preserved some SST6s for three or four seasons now that look really, really nice still uh, by using those shoe trees. So these are available now. I'm not sure 
uh, how limited the stock was on these or if they're just going to be available uh, in mass. I know the Belmo Gold shoes were limited, so we were very lucky to get a pair of those. Uh, so if you'd like to see an unboxing of those 3G uh, Gold Belmo shoes or if you'd like to see the unboxing of my Tour X's, uh, leave a comment down below, like, let me know. Uh, please subscribe. It helps me be able to keep bringing you videos like this. And uh, that's it. That's the 3G Tour Black. So once again, thank you so much for watching, and uh, we'll see you next time.